Good morning, Keller Williams, New Orleans, and welcome to The Smarter Agent. We got a new rule in place. It's something that we're gonna roll out effective immediately. From here on out, let's get our listing agreement signed by the broker before we put it into the multi-list. Some of you do your own input, some of you give uh, your input to the ladies at the front, but in any event, we want the listing agreement signed by the broker prior to you putting it into the multi-list. This is a new rule, and I'd like it if everybody could pay attention to it. Uh, the Louisiana Real Estate Contract Law states, and I will read, a contract is an agreement by two or more parties whereby obligations are created, modified, or extinguished. So we don't have a contract unless the contract has been signed by both parties. It's a bilateral contract because it's between us and them. And a contract is formed by consent of the parties through offer and acceptance, which again means it needs a signature. Um, it's got to be communicated and received, so once you get my signature on it, you do have to share that back with your seller. That's also our Louisiana law. And written acceptance is received, but it comes into the possession of the address E or the person authorized to receive it for the address E. Again, let's get these things signed by the broker prior to going into MLS and make sure you turn it back over to your seller so they have a copy of that executed contract. Thanks, agents, and have a great day. Be smart.